This old Mi Control Hub 2 is quite different from the new generation of Xiaomi Home Hubs. Don't be misled, the older model is named Mi Control Hub, while the new one is Xiaomi Home Hub. The new generation of hubs from Xiaomi are more technically equipped with the latest connection protocols like dual band Wi-Fi, supports both Zigbee and Bluetooth, as well as Bluetooth mesh, wired network port, high capacity memory, and its engine is a dual core CPU with a speed of up to 1 gigahertz. The older control hub 2 has only 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi and Zigbee connections and cannot directly connect to it Wi-Fi only devices like Xiaomi cookers and other devices. The new generation Home Hub 2 integrates these WLAN devices. But still, this has features that we need at home. Loudspeaker and bright night light. Una sa lahat, mag-subscribe muna kayo sa aking channel para suportahan ito. You may also join this channel as a member to avail of exclusive perks like priority in comments reply and early access or exclusive access to some videos for members only. You can also help fund some projects here by sharing super tanks. I bought this Mi Control Hub 2 along with a number of motion and contact sensors and a smart switch in a package sometime early in 2021 and all of it are still working until today. The hub doubles as a nightlight and a loudspeaker to sound off an alarm. On the other hand, the new generation of Xiaomi home hubs are a lot like a boring piece of small square devices that have some ports but no lights or speakers. All those devices in the packets can be controlled on the hub too and all of it can be set as alarm trigger devices when the hub is armed. You can designate a sound to play on the hub or turn on its light or both when the window is open or someone is entering the house at any time of the day. The sensors can trigger a sound or light on the hub if any of the windows or door remain open after a set time. Or you can turn on the night light on the hub when motion is detected by motion sensors at any scheduled time. The automation doesn't limit only to the hub's child devices. The hub can either sound off an alarm or turn on its night light if other Xiaomi devices are triggered. For example, I programmed the hub to sound off an alarm if the air purifier has detected bad air inside the house. If you open the Mi Control Hub on the Mi Home app, you'll be opening the uh, Mi Control Hub page, then the default tab is guard. You tap, you tap the colored light tab, and there you see the color wheel for the Mi Control Hub 2. If you tap the center, uh, it will turn on the, the light, and you can adjust the color on the color wheel. Let's see, see green. Then you have blue, you have purple, you have red, orange, then you go to yellow, then to bright light, that's bright light, and you can also adjust the brightness here, it's 100% from 3%, that's 3%, then this is 50%, and this is 100%, and you can actually uh, add some timer if you want then uh, you can automate the uh, induction light by using sensors so here I have two sensors that can uh, trigger the night light based on the actions that I'm going to uh, I'm setting here and you can set that uh, the time or schedule for this uh, automation will take effect I put here from 3 o'clock in the afternoon up to 5 o'clock in the morning. For the guard settings, you can uh, tap guard settings below. Then uh, you can see here your trigger, trigger devices. So I, uh, you can turn on or turn off. Uh, for example, this one, I can turn that off also if I don't need to use the sensor as my 
uh, alarm trigger device. When you say alarm trigger device, these are the devices that can cause or trigger alarms when your uh, hub is armed. Then uh, you can schedule the alarm. You have time here. You can set the, the, the time if you want. My setting here is from midnight to early morning, 5 o'clock. Then you can also delay the uh, activation of the uh, alarm. Let's say uh, once you trigger the alarm, you, you, have, you still have a little time to uh, leave the area. For example, you have 5 seconds, 15 seconds, 30 seconds, and up to 1 minute. And you can also set the alert tones and light settings. For example, alert ringtone, I have set the police car tone one. I can change that to, for example, air raid alarm. Or I can go back to police car tone one. And my dog is barking. <laughs> and you can set the alert duration at a, from one minute up to 10 minutes or you can custom uh, set the length over the duration of the alert and for the lights you can change uh, the light blinking uh, again this is the same one from 30 seconds to 10 minutes or to custom setting or no blink at all it will not the light will not blink you can easily add the control hub to on the Mi Home app by tapping the add button. You can add device. The app may automatically discover the, the device and it will be added uh, automatically or you can just add it manually by going down, going to the list below and look for router and gateway. You choose gateway and you may select the first or the second uh, devices here, whichever is appropriate, and just uh, follow the prompts. When it comes to physical installation, the Mi Control Hub 2 is no hassle since it is a plug-in type and on a Wi-Fi connection. Look for the most ideal location where to plug in the hub. In my case, I transferred the hub from the ground floor to my staircase so that it would be nearer to the bedroom. This way, if the alarm is triggered during our sleep, we can be awakened by the sound of the alarm. Also, the night light of the lamp can illuminate this area here in my house, which is dark most of the time. I set up a motion sensor in the staircase to trigger the light when someone is moving here. The Mi Controls Hub 1 and 2 are definitely old models, but these are not obsolete for now. If you don't need a loud alarm and a night light on a hub, then go for the new generation Xiaomi home hubs one and two in my case if ever i'll buy a new hub i should choose home hub two since it's faster at one gigahertz double with that of the home hub one and i believe the home hub two can incorporate this me control hub two so i can still use the alarm and night light here by the way aside from the control hubs there's also the multi-mode gateway three which can connect bluetooth devices as well as zigbee check this video here if you have any ideas on control hubs and the home hubs put it in the comment section below